Welcome to the ANA Money Museum's Mini Mint. The Mini Mint is a functional exhibit that shows how coins were made in 1792 when the first U.S. Mint was opened in Philadelphia. We use modern equipment similar to what was used 250 years ago, but smaller so that one person can operate them. To begin with, the metal used for coins has to be prepared. It would normally be delivered to the mint in the form of ingots similar to this one. Obviously, it needs some work before it will look like a coin. First, it would be melted down to create a thin strip of metal using a mold. This strip would be further prepared by running it through a rolling mill, which uses adjustable rollers to thin and smooth the metal down to the correct thickness for a coin. The next step is to use a cutting press that uses cutters to cut perfect circles of the metal, known as blinks. The leftover metal, known as a web, will be melted down and reused. At this point, we are beginning to see what our coins will look like, so now it is time to add the designs for our new coins. The first step in adding designs to our new coins is to take the blanks to our castang machine, better known as an upsetting mill. The upsetting mill allows us to add an edge design to our blanks along with a raised rim, known as an upset, which makes the blank easier to strike in the final step for making our coin. The striking press puts the final touch to our new coin by adding designs to the front and back of the blank, now known as the obverse and reverse. To do this, we place the upset blank between the two dies in the press and then strike the dies onto the blank, transferring the design perfectly and creating a beautiful new coin.